What's up, Chuckle Fox? Um, I'm an idiot because I missed day 400 and I was planning on making a video and I didn't. And no one even watches, so it doesn't even matter, so I don't even care. So, yeah, here's my locker review since everyone asked for it. First, I'm gonna start off with schematics because that's literally the only thing anyone cares about when in these things. You're like, oh god, who's gonna trap? Oh, are you gonna trade with me? I don't trade anymore. It's poo poo because I have all the guns except for all the mythics. First off, um, Storm King's Onslaught. Great. Phase Jarvis Pistol 101. Um, of course, I God rolled it. Shout out to Egg Chica over on Twitch for helping me get this. Um, really means a lot. And shout out to Beast on YouTube for helping me get this. They actually carried, both of them actually kind of carried me, by the way, so, yeah. Oh, and also shout out to Egg Chica for getting me this one, too. The Ahego faced rocket launcher. Just mouth wide open. Alright, I'm gonna stop talking. Um, yeah. I only use it on the Storm King, that really. Um, Bundle Bus, really good. When I first, I got it actually from a birthday llama. So, um, I didn't get it when it originally came out. Like, I was like, what kind of dumbass gun is this? Eight round burst my ass. I'm only using fully automatic, completely reasonable, um, uh, whatever I had back then. I had a scar. I had siege breakers back then because that's what I used. Um, surround pound. Oh my god, amazing. I love using this. It, I only, it was actually my first 130 and I only leveled it up so I could use it on the Storm King. And I still do and I still use it as a regular hammer. It's just really good. Um, boom bow, of course, um, just because I even needed a good sniper. And also it works really good with uh, Raparator Jonesy and Zenith because it does splash damage. So that those crits are gonna um, be really effective. Broadside, of course, God roll that. Founder's drum roll, God roll. That's like too many rolls, bro. And I'm fat, so I have extra rolls. <laughs> but I'm not that chunky. I'm just dummy thick. Um, I have double fire rate on there, and kind of like an LMG sort of build, because um, with bullets from Jonesy, crack shot, and then plasma arc from Cyberclops. It just is a bullet chaining LMG machine. Completely just drains your ammo and durability. You're only going to be using this about like for two missions and then it's dead. It's like an encampment mission and a half and it's dead. If it's shadow shot. If it's anything if it's anything blower, it's good. I probably should have made a bright core to keep the fire rate up. But it's still pretty good. Um with Bulletstorm Jonesy, you can empty the entire clip within like four and a half seconds. And it does like 150% more damage. No, 75% more damage. No, yeah, 100. No, double the damage, I mean. After 1.5 seconds of firing it. Because you need 50 bullets in order to do that. And like 19 bullets a second, that's going to take like. I don't know. I haven't done the math, but it just shreds. And like it's so fast that it breaks this audio, the audio barrier. So you like it doesn't seem like it's firing fast, but it is, and it's really good for wave clear. And I like the headshot explosion thing because it like does AOE damage. Um, still use it a lot, but not as much as I used to. Um, pain train, I got two of these. A lot of the a lot of these in this video, you're gonna see I have two of them. Uh, this one I got the crit build, another one I have damage, and this one of course I have energy, so it fights everything. I like using it on miss monsters and stuff because it just it's good like that. Um, Pulsar 9000, Ring of Death, amazing. Kind of, it. When I first saw it, it looked like a cannon on a uh, on a stick with a handle. I thought it was gonna be firing like balls. Like, like you know, it looks like a cannon. It doesn't look like it would fire rings. You know, it doesn't look like that. But when I first saw it, I was like, I need to get my hands on this. It's just amazing, dude. Um, floor spikes, cause why not? Santa's little Beanos pole dancing it's a that's that pole the north pole that's, that's a pole dancing thing i'm gonna shut up uh, i got damage 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 on this with the reload speed it does quite a bit of damage i don't like crit builds on explosive weapons unless it's this one because it's the only one where it's usable this one um staccato shadow my butto no um just got it leveled up to 106 because i need a better shotgun well, you go stinky, stinky. Got it. Still pretty stinky, but I like it. Um, Freezy McFreezer boy. I use this on Ice Queen and Zenith a lot because just 
It does more damage against Frozen, and it freezes them. Um, hate that I leveled this up. It was good at the time, but I hate it. Two Candicorn LMGs. Yeah, that's right. One I got. I'm not cheating. One I got from the birthday event, second one, and this one I got from the third Fort Nightmares. I was able to get it during the first one, but I didn't play enough, so... Rip. I got this one with triple crit damage for the Totally Rockin' Out with Breakbeat Wildcat and Physical. And this one's also Physical because it's locked to Physical. And I got just like damage, damage, damage stuff on it. So that way I can use it with Crack Shot. It's, it's just pretty nice. Um, this one, everyone has it. I want them to make it energy damage, please. Uh, this because you got to have those. This I use. I've never made a. I've never made one of these. And I God rolled it for no reason. Other than the purpose of making a video, and as of now, I do not have that video. So, if anyone would like to see it, even though no one watches these videos, um, comment down below. And I will n probably not work on it, but yeah, I don't know. I just need an idea if I should make this video or not. Um, I got the four times damage on there because this is, if you look at the bottom of the description, it says damage, range, and velocity increases rather than just range and velocity like the boom bow. So like you pull it back all the way, it's gonna be doing like macho, mucho, gusto, whatever you call it, damage. Um, this I got it when Zenith, when I had Zenith, so I could just freeze shit. But now I have the vacuum tube, so it don't matter. Um, that's a blaster, great in trap tunnels. Um, you used to use a lot of durability and wasn't really worth making. But since it has um, energy cells now, I'm probably gonna probably use that more often. But I don't know. And a lot of these are going to notice I only have 82, like all of them are 82 because I don't really have that much evolution material to be spending on this kind of stuff because um, so I only use mythics now, so um, anyways, besides that, yeah. I got this Dragon Drawer Rainbow Rolled when I first, when, actually I like put in the collection book, unslotted it, and then made it like this because I was like, eh, I just want a classic schematic in my thing. I wanted... The Roman Candle, the sixth perk, three of them I've got, and not one of them has had it. This one, good with the crit rating and whatnot, pretty nice, I like it. Uh, this one, I, I got it from the birthday event, and then I got a second one from the Fort Nightmares 3. So this one, this one, and this one I have two schematics of. This one I got from the original Frost Knight, I did the first challenge for it, it's pretty good. I know one of my friends who never plays has this schematic, so yeah. But I love this thing. Um, Grave Digger, everyone has it. Whether you like it or not, you have it. And you'll get it eventually if you don't. I miss that this used to be good. I remember it used to be a usable weapon that wouldn't just like fire out pellets of rabbit poop. And just actually do stuff. It's such an iconic gun. It's like what people trade. It used to be currency in this game. If you could craft these, you, you you were friends with a lot of people, but now everyone has it after Fort Nightmares 2, so it doesn't even matter. I have two of them. Ground Pounder for the uh, Clay Pigeon, whatever. Um, Hemlock, I got this during the original Frost Knight, 2018. I loved it at the time. I thought it was better than the, whatchamacallit, the Silent Spectre, because it just fired so fast. I used to have a gold sp Silent Spectre. Like, later you're going to see that I have a purple one. But, like, I used to have a gold one, but I didn't like the sixth perk, which was, like, headshot explosions cause damage. So I don't do that no more. Hot Mix, oh my god, it is amazing. At first I was like, ew, this is a poo-poo pee-pee weapon, because it didn't, it didn't sound loud enough to do that. But it does. It is good. Like, with this one, you can only change it to, like, three different things. I originally had it physical, but then I changed it to energy, because the plasma arc chain so yeah um this one i only got uh what was it i only have the double crit damage on their god rolled because uh first shot rio but like since totally rocking now it doesn't matter but i still like this um jack -o launcher a year and a half to get this oh my god it was such a pain fortnite it was birthday event one i didn't get any i only got two of the survivors two of the three that i needed i thought i got the third one but it was an epic um husky so it didn't count. Second Fort Nightmares, I didn't get it because I didn't play a lot. Hated it myself because of that. Um, birthday 2, was it? 
I thought they were gonna have it in there, but they didn't. And then Fort Nightmares 3, I finally got it, leveled it up. I regret it, but it's such a classic schematic. Like if you don't have it, you're missing out. It's it's nice. It brings back memories. I I have a friend who originally could craft them, but like he doesn't play anymore. Jack's Revenge. I used I did a stupid ass test with this. I missed the headshot and just you know noped right out of the situation. It was it like it does a lot of damage. Three hundred two thousand. Damn. But like I missed that headshot, so it, it didn't even do anything. This one, oh my god, I missed out on the first um, Fort Nightmares. When was it came out? And I hated that I didn't get it because I had Calamity, but I didn't have her gun. The one thing that made Calamity good was this gun, and I was using stuff like the Ginger Blaster when I had it. I didn't get this because it was dog poo poo at the time. But I got this. I wanted this because it was actually good. It was rare too because like no one really cared about it. It was just a novelty looking gun but it did damage. Oh my god. But then I got it during the second birthday event so I'm glad. This one I got during the second birthday event too. I haven't re-rolled it because I used to play low level missions around that time. Pretty good. I liked it a lot. When I first saw it I was like ew. It's just like ew. It's poo poo. But I saw a video on it later and I was like... I should have got that one as good. But I didn't. This one, this is the second out of the three that I have. The first one, I leveled up to a 106. Thought it was pretty good. Made it all magazine rolls. Couldn't have, didn't have enough reprick to change them all back. Recycled it before, so that way I could level up survivors. Got this one, made it 82 at least. And then got a third one, put that in the collection book finally. This one, so many memories with this. The f one of the first legendaries I could craft, and like the first thing that I started trading, like, you, oh, give me this, and I'll give you, I'll give you X amount of these. Like it was, it's such a good gun at the time. It's probably poo poo now because I haven't used it in like a year. But it is, oh my god, it brings back so many memories. I used to use this, and then Ragnarok around during C the first birthday event. Because like I thought this one was, uh, I thought this one was good, and it was rare at the time too. Like getting anything from Birthday Mount Llamas still was rare, but like this, this was like rare, kind of rare. It, you got epic stuff more than you got legendary. Um, this one I got from the Birthday Llama, not knowing it was rare. Almost recycled it one time because there was another one in the shop, but it was it's such a good pickaxe, like better than anything. I just wish you didn't have to reload. Um, old Betsy, I wanted to use it instead of Bundle Bus for the Storm King. Long story short, it didn't happen. Pain Train, the second one that I have, damages on it. Oh my god, it does so much with Rescue Trooper Ramirez, it's insane. I like it more than the crit damage one, but, you know, it's still pretty good. Um, Ralphie's Revenge, Poo Poo, I, thought, I got it during Season 7 when I thought it was good. Poo Poo, stinky, garbage weapon. Hate that I leveled it up, because it's bad. Ratatat, or Ratatatatatatat, it's like... Every gangster's gun, that's what it's called. And it just shreds. I love it. So much better than the blast of boop. Room Sweeper, one of the first, it was actually the first legendary that I remember having. Cause I used to think, oh, it did like 33,000 damage. I didn't know like it increased over time with each z zone. So yeah. That's still a good, a classic weapon. It's, it, and I like the way it looks too. It needs, I think it needs a buff, like piercing rounds or something, you know? Anyways, not that much on that. Santa's little boopus too, with damage and damage to afflicted. I have another one with just damages on it, but this one I use damage to afflicted, so that way it, it's kind of an idea I have. First, you use um, the good one with all the damage rolls, boom. You switch to this one, boom, it's going to do even more damage. Because it has the damage to afflicted, so yeah. But you have to reload both, so I didn't go with that. Um, Sir Lancelot got it when it first came out. Cause like, oh my god, you can charge with it. Oh my god, you poke with it, and not every spear pokes. Um, this one I hate that I leveled it up because I got Black Knight during season eight. I was like, oh, I need to get a hammer for him, but I didn't have any, so I just leveled this up. But then during the birthday event, oh, they just they just had they just had to completely ruin my style with this. But I'm grateful that I got it. I don't like this one, though. 
um, snowball launcher because everyone has it. I miss that the CO2 in there was on the outside of the gun. It was funny. Got two of these. This one for Paleo Luna. This one for Deadly Blade Crash. This one is just like the da like a shredder. This one's like just for paper cuts. Um, Saw what square? Not good. Not bad. Pierces. It's all right. This I got rolled for um, anti cutlacera so you can just keep shoom 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 over again. Baron, pretty good. I like the movement speed. I only do it, craft these if I have an active power cells to, to spare. Jabberwocky, got it when it was alright during season 7, Frost Knight, but it's bad now. Um, this one, Poo Poo. Two of these different elements, same rolls, but Poo Poo. I thought they were good at the time. They look good, but they're bad. Um, the V6, because I thought I needed it instead of the... Um, I was I was planning on using this instead of a deatomizer, but my friend crafted them, so I was like, oh, it's good, never mind, we're good, I don't need to level this up anymore. Um, vacuum tube, double crit rating for Zenith, that it's a, my freeze gun, nothing else. That, this, because I leveled it up, Wraith, amazing. That, with the energy so I can do plasma arc and chain with cyberclops. Uh, Silent Spectre, I got causes affliction, if I get another one, that does um, still ensnared. I'm gonna get it because I'm not like affliction on the silent specter. Um, tar pit, cause yeah, 69 bobcat, nice. 69 fighters night cleave. I use this really for frost knight whenever I need a melee weapon. And then sound wall 69, nice. And then the baron, 69 speed. Oh my god, amazing. Um, this one, yeah. I thought this was good, but it's bad. Thought this was good, but it's bad. Uh, it's good, but I haven't leveled it up, and it kind of looked like it has two nipples on the top. So yeah, um, this one I thought it was good, but it's bad, and I don't like it. And I have two of them, cause you could get it from like the Wild West llamas, and I got one, and I just put it in the collection book, cause why not? Instead of putting this one that I hate, I look. It looks cool, dude. Oh my god. I wish it was good because it looks amazing. Um, that because I got it when when I did that because I need those. This one is pretty much a movement. When I got it first time, I was like, "Yo, it's amazing!" But like, that was during season seven Frost Night, so I didn't really use it. Um, but yeah, I use I have it now, so got two movement speed perks on it, so it can get around and storm shields with ninjas. Um, this one, why not? Bear, it used. I used to use this side by side with my Siege Breaker before I recycled it. This one, cause why not? Floor Spookies. Um, I got this thinking I was gonna level it up, but I never got to that. That that. This is my old one of my oldest schematics. I got it during the birthday event, first one. Never bothered leveling up past this. But yeah, I got that. I got this one from the. I got it from the birthday llamas, I think, but I don't remember how I got this. It was from one of the original, or maybe it was in the event store. I don't remember, but I have it, and I'm glad that I do, because I like the way it looks. I used to use it all the time, because I liked the way it looked, and that was it. So, yeah. But they need to buff this, and then I'll use it again. This one, my first birthday llama thing that I got. Got the 25 plus impact, 400 knockback magnitude. I have no idea what that means, but I have it. And then the rest of these are 34. Of course, I got my God Rule Stop Axe, because you got to get those. And then a lot of bonus other stuff. Told you I had th two of these. Um, got that. Why not? Got every, I have every schematic, even the ones that I don't like. That. Don't like that. Don't like that. That. Bad. It's all right. Don't like that. Don't like that. Um like everything that you can need. if anyone wants to see a video on any of these that I have just leave them in the comments and I'll try to get to it eventually um but yeah I, most of these I just get so I don't have to like because one day they're good and then I was like oh, I should have got that because that's happened so many times in the past I've gotten good stuff but it's bad I've gotten I didn't get bad stuff because then it turned out to be good so yeah um and then, of course, the best weapon in the game, the semi-auto handgun, the handmade. The best gun in the game. You cannot play without it. It is so good. Better than any mythic. No, I'm kidding. 
But yeah, um, backpack just got a bunch of schematics that I'm just gonna skim over. Some of these I've had for the longest time. I got this during season eight of last March. Cause some guy gave it to me before they became rare. He's like, just, just have them while they're rare, and, you know, do that. This one, I don't know if I made this on purpose or not. Um, and yeah, and then I made every one rarity of, or every level of the mythic launcher. Got some of these God Roll Stop axes they just hand out. Um, ammo that got barely any here for resources. I used to have a ton of nuts and bolts, but now I, I spent them all on energy cells. I got a lot more here. I got some spectral light and rainbow crystal. That's it. Need more resources. Um, yeah, I got some coal left over. How much do I have right now on me? Only 62. Sheesh, I need some. Um, traps. These are rare because they don't have any rolls on them. And, like, you can't... Cr no one craft the boost pads with, um, with like, power level 21. And some spare ammo, and then some spare weapons. I don't remember how I got these. I remember some guy gave these to me when they were good, but it, they're not that... Someone gave this to me, um, before I had my god roll stuff. And then I found this randomly, and it's pretty nice. Uh, heroes. Um... Every I have every mythic in the game, so every team perk in the game. So that's pretty nice. I'm glad that I do. Um, I'm just gonna scroll over these. Can't not gonna really explain anything about them. But like now, every time there's a hero, I get it just because I need it. And the birthday event really helped because look, there's a lot I can count that I got from the birthday. Um, one that I did get was uh, this. Because I didn't know how good he was. I got... Uh, um, oh, damn, where are I, what, what did I get from the roof? I, I already forgot. Um, no, I got that. I bought him. Uh, hmm. I got her from the birthday event. Got... Well, these are the second one. Got him. Uh, got... Damn, there's a lot. I don't remember what I got. I remember I got him. No, I bought him. Yeah, I have everything now, so it's hard to remember where I got everything from. Uh, a lot of the stuff I just have. Um, I got two of these from birthday event. Got her from the birthday event and her, because I didn't, even though I didn't like him at all, I would have appreciated something else. And then him, I hate him so much. Uh. And then other, this is the everything else. And I also got some spare stuff. And I'm never going to make this guy legendary because screw you. He's only for support. For mental, emotional, and physical support. And then, yeah. Uh, I'm not going to go over here, loadouts. Uh, these, I just got, I only use these five, really. Jill. Jill. Alright. You, you're, you're rare. Not everybody has you. But no really pays attention, and you don't have as many roles as everyone else, so you're bad. Survivors, squads, oh my god. When I finally got all of them legendary and above, it was so good. Jesus. Everything. You got this, that, 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 that. I only got this one, this one, and almost this one maxed out. Um, these, this one and these one are the only one with, like, completely... Um, matching set bonuses. Uh, this one's almost completely matching, but I'd need a, another health bonus for it. Do I probably have one somewhere. Yeah, I have one, but it's a different thing. I know I got one. So I only keep the Fort Nightmares ones because they have names. Besides from everything else, I just recycle. And then I got this. Um, Upgrades, I have everything upgraded except for this, and then once I get this done, I'm going to just focus on that, and then I'm done. Um, max out my research. Uh, quest page, uh, I'm only on that so far. Um, only got 210 V-Bucks. Uh, Use code PIZO, the, I's is, the O's is zero. That, don't have that much gold. I still need to get him, then I'm going to get him, her, and then her for the collection book. Pickaxes, sure, why not? Um, I have every tier 100 since season three, so I have every pickaxe from that battle pass. So if you're curious if I have all the styles, most likely do or eventually will have all the styles. So 
Um, yeah, that'll help. Uh, yeah, I got a lot of stuff. This was my actually my first pickaxe. I first got it, I was like, yo, you could upgrade your pickaxe, because I thought the default pickaxe was like one damage. This one was like five damage or something, because it just looks like that. I don't know. I was but I didn't know how to play the game. It was two years ago. Chill. Actually, over two years ago. Um, I have all the dances. I'm not going to go over them. Well, all the battle pass ones, at least. And some of the meme ones that you got to get. Wraps. Favorite one right now is this one and that one. And then the bubble flash. The, the camo wrap. The good one. Not the dog fight. <laughs> this one. Ew. Because, like, half. You only see the front half of the gun because the rest use covering it, so it's bad. And then I have all the loading screens. I like to use this one because it gives me nostalgia. So, and yeah. Um, let's go over the collection book because, like, you know, why not? Um, got that maxed out. I probably could have put the typewriter in here, but they need to make it available to research. Because then I'll do it. Um, I mean, it could unslide at any time, but, like, I wouldn't. I'm pretty sure. Wait, do I have one of these? Let me put it in the collection book. If I have it, I'm putting it in the collection book. Yeah, I don't have it. Survivors, I got most of them maxed out. I actually got these. I have two of him. I got one of her from a llama. I got one of her for free. And I got one of him from a llama. I don't like any of them. Range weapons, we already went over that. Melee weapons. Of course, you got this. I still need a clax. I probably have one, but I don't know. Got all that maxed out. Still need the those two. I got all the swords. I remember when this used to be the good sword in the game. This used to be the best one, but it's not because it's doo-doo. And then this, and I still need one that last hammer. Traps, no homo. Got most of them. Can you research these? Yeah, I can. Um, those, these. Didn't get any of these. I don't like. I don't like them. They're not worth it. And plus, I don't even know my account information. Holiday stuff. I could put more stuff in the collection book, but I don't. Um. Yeah, I actually have two jingle jesses. So if you're wondering, yeah. And then I have two crack shots because I got one from the after the chapter two release. I got this one so I could get the LMG stuff done. And then I got another one from the Christmas event. And then I have... I can have two of these, but only got one of those. I actually bought both of them originally, so... Yeah, and I have every Mythic. And if you see anything in the collection book, I have double of them. Yeah, I got two of these. I got one of those. One of I think I have two of these. I don't know. Definitely have two of those. Um, got those. I have both of these. I wish I got this one for one of the quest lines so I could put in the collection book but I didn't because I'm an idiot and I got one of these disgusting outlanders like these these were the classic fort nightmares yeah um that was maxed out I have everything here I don't have another one of him never got him or him because I was saving up for birthday llamas that entire time got everything here everything here except except um, America's ass. Yeah, that's America's ass. And um, Miss Big Chungus. I'm gonna get her next time she comes out, even though she literally doesn't do anything useful. And then I don't have any of these. I the only one that I want. I actually need all of them, except for her, because energy cost does not matter. Um, got every one of those. See, I got two of these. Yeah. Um. This one was this one was actually my most recent mythic because I didn't have them originally. I didn't know you could buy them and get the double the triple jump when he first came out. Yeah, I got two of these. I thought I had another one of those. Damn, I don't. Um. And then I got this, except for him. Everything I have here, and I have two of her. And yeah, and that um, vent stuff. I have everything in here. Everything in here, ex 
shop. No, yeah, I got everything here. And this is actually called the Song Song, because that's what a dirge is. Um, got everything here. I don't know why, I don't know why this was put into the Fort Nightmares, because it ain't. And it never came out. Two of those, two of those, two of those, two of those. Mm, one of those, one, two of those. Got everything from here. Uh, everything from here. Even though it's on the collection book. Didn't get that. Only got an epic version of that. One of those. Two of those. One of those. Never got that. N wish I got that. N got that. And then got that. Everything I have here. I have a bundle boost. I put this in the collection book because it's bad. And I have both of these. Um, these. I got that. I got that. Told you got two of those. Here I got everything. And then only have the dragon rifles. This one doesn't have the roman candle neither does this one even if you could check to upgrade it expansion people i originally my one of my first ones was this one and i thought she was good with the left and righty but she wasn't and then i have everything from here everything here except a gold ted shot i don't know if i have everything here i hate i hate these these are pretty bad except except for deadly blade crash because she's really good with swords um, got everything here. I still need the, this and that, and I'm done with the mythics. Got everything, got everything, got two obliterators. Got my second LMG here, that, that, yada yada. Yeah, uh huh. Oh shit, you can put in the collection book now? Hollow. Oh, and I can put this one in there. Everything in here too. I used to have the Dam Buster as one of my main rocket launchers, actually. Then I got the Bazooka, and I was like, nah, I'm going to get that one, because that one looks nicer. No, actually, I got the Bazooka originally, and then this one, because it did more damage. I don't see a lot of these anymore, for some reason. I don't know if they do as, mu as much damage as they used to, or as I remember. Um, but then I traded that out for the Noble Launcher, I think. I don't know. I forgot what happened. It's old. And then I got out most of these. So yeah, um, got a lot of XP boosts that I don't use, and I got a small PP that no one wants to use. So yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, I guess I could just conclude whatever I was trying to do with this video. And next time it comes up to 500 days, I'm gonna probably miss it again. So don't expect anything. And later.